you know, um, what Ross and Holder did tonight. Certainly, uh, you know, I know there are a lot of people out there saying, my God, this, this guy's done, what is it, 21 consecutive scoreless innings or whatever it is. And why are you taking him out of this ballgame in the seventh? And it's because you got contact hitter at the plate, you got freshman hitter coming up to the plate who's never seen Jonathan Holder or his breaking ball. Um, you got an 0-2 count, and we just can't afford. That's where the whole ball game is. You can't allow contact there if you have that in your bullpen. And certainly, that's what Jonathan Holder is. He, he, there are times where he's just not going to allow contact, especially right on right with an 0-2 count there. So I thought that was the whole ball game right there. You know, Brayton steps up and hit, gets the ball out of the ballpark. I think it's a great story for him. I remember as a kid coming back here and playing. It was special. You know, a lot of your your friends and you know you're from the state of Alabama and. Yeah, I think it was really neat for him. I thought he defended well today. Um, but we just we kind of did what we did do. We, we pitched and pitched and pitched, played defense, and we scored enough. And um, you know, I'm just really proud of our kids for you know, continuing the battle. One run is enough when Ross is on the mound sometimes. It, it is. He's just a wizard, you know, and it, 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 that's why you hate to take him out there. And I know he's probably frustrated that we are taking him <laughs> out. but. You know, he, he's just, he gets it. I mean, he really gets it, and so does Jonathan Holder. But that, that was Holder's moment at the end. But combined, that's, that's a pretty good couple of guys to, to help you win an SEC series right there. And in a 1-0 game, defense really steps up. Britton was really good, and then Vickerson throwing the guy off the plate, obviously, was Huge really big. play. Vickerson coming to get that ball, being super aggressive, throwing him out at the plate. Yeah, championship-level clubs make those kind of plays, and that's what we want to be. You know, are we there yet? No. But those are the strides you make. It's what championship clubs do, and uh, really, you know, pleased to see that. I think you left eight on base the first four innings, but at the same time, you got Turnbull's pitch count up. Yeah, we got his pitch count up. What, what we didn't do is we had the we had two or three sequences where we don't even get a, a swing off of the run and scoring position. We just can't be that club. Turnbull's great. Not trying to take anything away from him, but you can't be that club that doesn't get your swing off with a run and scoring position. That part's disappointing, but. You know, we did enough, and, and uh, Alabama's a really good club. We just want to see we got an opportunity. It's something special you don't get to do in our league a whole lot, and that's uh, sweep a team on the road. So you, know, you look at Alabama's RPI, you look at their season, they're, they're a very good club, and we need to come out come out swinging tomorrow because uh, they're, they're going to do everything they can to salvage a ball game. Here.